Hello everyone. Welcome back to our YouTube channel Scratch Learners. Today we will discuss about the deletion algorithm with an example and we will also discuss the C++ code for deletion of an element. So what is deletion? Deletion operation refers to removing an existing element from the array. That means deletion simply means to delete a element from the array. Removal of any element from the end of the array is very simple operation as no data movement is involved in this process. Okay, if we want to delete an element from the last position, then we can simply traverse the whole array and we will delete the element at the last position. But for all other elements of the array, if we want to delete any particular element in the in between the array, then all the elements starting from the location next to deletion position need to be moved one position left in the array. What does it mean? Let's understand this with an example. Consider an array S having five elements. Okay, so this is the array. Although there are seven memory blocks, but there are five elements present in it. Okay, so if we want to delete the element 13, which is present at index 2, then we need to shift all the elements after 13 to one position left. That means what is the next element after 13? It is 4 and 8. So we will shift the element 4 from index 3 to index 2. Okay. Then we will shift the element 8 from index 4 to index 3. Right. So th how this array will look after deletion of 13? 2 will be at this position. 7 will stay here only then 4 will be shifted to index 2 so 4 will be here then 8 will be stored in this position as it is also shifted so see here the element 13 is deleted let's understand the algorithm for deletion of an element from the array so here the array contains an element and we want to delete the element at kth position so let this be the array here n equals to 8 from index 0 to index 7 and we want to delete the element 9 which is at index 4 so here k equals to 4 right see in this algorithm step 1 is used for looping step 2 and step 3 for i equals to k to n minus 2 that is from the index at which element is to be deleted to the index of the second last element of the array okay so here k equals to 4 so i will point to k so i equals to 4 then s of i equals to s i plus 1 right so s of 4 equals to s 4 plus 1 that means 5 so the element at fifth index will be shifted to the fourth index right the array will look like this 4, 7, 6, 2 will remain as it is, right? We want to delete the 9 element. So 3, that is the element at 5th position, will be shifted to the 4th position. So 3 will be stored here. Then i equals to i plus 1. Okay. So now i will be 5. Right? Then again we will check this. Whether i is less than equals to n minus 2. So here n minus 2 will be 8 minus 2 equals to 6. So this loop will run till n equals to 6. So now i equals to 5. So 5 is less than 6. Then again si equals to si plus 1. Now i equals to 5. So s5 equals to s6. That is this element 8 will be shifted to the 5th index. So it will be stored here. Right. Then again i equals to i plus 1 so i equals to 6 then again 6 is less than equal to 6 it's also true so this statement will be executed that means the shifting of the element so s6 equals to s7 right what is the element at seventh index it's 1 so it will be shifted to the sixth position so 1 will be stored here now if we will increment the value of i then is it will be 7 so 7 is not less than equals to 6 so we will come out of this loop 
here we are exiting from the loop when all the element from the index k to index n are shifted one position left so outside the loop in step 4 as we have deleted an element so the number of elements should decrease by one so that's what it's done here then the exit statement so this is the algorithm for the deletion operation of an element from the array see this is the c++ code for deletion of an element from the array we are starting within the main block by declaring an array of size 10 and of type integer right at first we will input the number of elements in the variable n okay then we will enter all the elements one by one and we will store the elements in the array at position i starting from 0 up to n minus 1 then we will input the index of the element to be deleted in the variable pos now if pos greater than n that means the position of the element which is to be deleted is greater than the size of the array so this is not possible right so in this case deletion is not possible else we will execute a loop here the array indexing is starting from 0 so the loop will start from pos minus 1 so we will shift all the elements of the array after the index of deletion to one position left right we need to shift all the elements so this is what it's done in this step array at location i equals to array at location i plus 1 then when all the elements are shifted by one position left then the control will come out of this loop and n equals to n minus 1 that means the size of array will decrease by 1 as we have deleted an element in this statement we will just print all the elements of the array after deletion so let's run this program see here we need to enter the number of element so let the number of element be 6 then input the elements so 7 3 2 13 8 45 right now we need to input the index of element which is to be deleted okay so let we want to delete the third element okay so we will write 3 here now see the third element is 2 okay and see here 2 is deleted and all the rest elements are printed right so this is the c++ program for deletion of an element from the array if you like this video please subscribe my channel please like and share this video with your friends thank you